Hey, hello guys, welcome back. This is Viren Kumar. So, today in this video session of the Jenkins series, I am going to discuss about the project creation on the Jenkins. So, this video will help you how to create the project in Jenkins, how to configure the Git project into, into the Jenkins, and how to execute a build in the Jenkins. And then we will I verify the console output on the Jenkins. Okay, so to create the project, you yeah already log into the Jenkins that is running on the uh, as of now on my default port number eight zero eight zero. Okay, this is my default port number where I'm running the Jenkins. And if you are not configured the Jenkins, then then you can go to my channel and first you can subscribe the channel, then you can watch the how to uh, con create the Jenkins file and how to launch the Jenkins on the local system okay then once you have done this one then you can go to this URL this port number and there you can see the screen like this so this is the first home screen of the Jenkins okay where you will uh, get the plus new items any items on the left side of the Jenkins UI okay so there you are seeing the one plus new item so to create the project we will go to this new item options and we will create on this new items after that it will ask you to enter the item name means that it is asking the project name so we can see this is the demo project okay we provided the name of the uh, Jenkins project now there are the different type of the options like how you want to create the project freestyle project directly maven project there is a pipeline project external job project folder multi multi branch projects and organization folders so what type of the project you want to create there are the different type of the projects you can create if you are not seeing these many options then you need to configure through the manage Jenkins that we will discuss in the another video but as of now I am going to consider this is the freestyle project okay and if you have the maven project then you can uh, create the maven project for that okay so I am going to select the freestyle project so let's click on this one and you say okay once you have the project name then you can see this window there you, you need to do some configurations okay so here i am going to show how to configure the project okay so you can see there are the many tabs are there general tabs source code management tab build trigger how to trigger the build build environment build tab and the post build actions okay so there are many options are there we will go one by one and we will talk that which is the necessary to run a build okay so under the general you can uh, give the descriptions like this this is demo project okay you can provide the descriptions about your project okay and then you can see these many options you can ignore all these options okay you no need to select any of them now the source code management like where is your source code so if your source code in the git bitbucket svn you need to select the source code repository so in my earlier videos i have shown that this is my eclipse project i have created this project suppose this is the my project and this is the java code that i push to the git repository so where is my git repository this is my git repository okay i have created the github account and there i push my code under the master branch so my code on the git repository so this code on the cloud okay you cannot do the direct integrations with the your source code to the jenkins so before that you need to push 
the code on the github or any source code management platform and there you can do the configurations into the jenkins so as of now i have my code in the github.com okay and this is my jenkins so it is asking the source code management so what i will do i'll select the git okay and there it is asking please enter the git repository path so if you go if you need any help you can click on this question mark and it will give you the help and informations how to do the configurations okay so please enter the git repository so now what is the uh, complete path to provide the git repository name so for that you can go to your source code uh, project okay there you can see you can select the branch where your project is pushed so this is my master branch okay as of now if it, this is the name with your branch like uh, your project name your you, you will have the different branches in your project if you are working in an organization so you can select the recommended branch name here then you will get the project okay and after that you can go to the code sections and there you select the https sections okay and you can copy this path and come to the jenkins and there you can paste so this is your test automation dot git repository okay and then it is asking the credentials if you have the credentials you can you need to configure the credentials other, otherwise you can put the null so i provided if you want to add the new one then you can click on the add jenkins and there you can add the username okay you can provide the username means to log in this github account so that you need to provide so you have you you need to have the one github account with that you can log into this account okay if your project is the public then you no need to provide the credentials if it is the private then you need to provide the credentials then i am saying the username is like your project username and you can provide the password and add it once you have done that one then you will get the options here under the drop down so you can select the credentials okay and then you can scroll down then you need to provide the branch name so star slash master so we will refer this code to the master branch so you configure the branch okay now come down to the build trigger section so how you want to trigger the build okay as of now leaving in the blank we want to trigger manually then in next video we will show how to build automatically okay you can scroll down and then you can save your configurations part okay once it is done then you can go to again the configurations to check the configurations correctly or not so you can see the informations are already saved here okay that's fine then we will go to the uh, build section so before that if you are going to configure the git for that what you need to do you can go to the dashboard and you can go to the manage jenkins okay and under the manage jenkins you can go to the global tool configurations under the global tool configurations you need to provide the git executable so this is the my git executable part means i have installed the git on my local systems and then i have this folder on my local system so that part you need to provide if you are referring the git command to be execute so c program git bin and git dot exe you need to provide the git dot exe otherwise you will get the git error during the source code management configurations if you want the install automatically then you can provide and the install automatically on the jenkins but as of now we are going to refer to the local system install git repository okay so this configurations you can do how we can go to our dashboard so on the dashboard you can see all the projects created 
okay so we have created the demo project now we want to build this project okay so you can click on this project and then you can see the status change of workspace build now so i want to click on the build now and then you can see the build is already executed here okay then the, this is the build number hash one is the build number one you can click on this build and you can see the build this is the date 14th august on this time we have executed the first build and this is the console output of this build so started by the user admin we i am the user admin running as a system this is the workspace is already created for this one okay and this is the build success now this is the very small like uh, git command we it just a checkout process that's why it's uh, executed so quickly okay and build information so you can provide if you want to delete the build you can have the options and you can delete the build here now the configurations you can go to the configurations and we want to execute some maven command for that so we want to build trigger we want the build step so so mvn mvn clean test and save it and build now okay so the mvn clean test is running first it will clean the project okay so it is saying the build is successful and you can see the running test case 1 hello java running test case 2 running test case 3